Uh, we're going to start with opening prayer. Uh, we're going to invite Pastor Buki to come up to give us the opening prayer. What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? Make some noise. No, wait. Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. Did we come here to have a good time? Then we better behave like we came here to have a good time. Make some necessary noise. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I'm supposed to do the opening prayer, but Dickie Sam is here. Or Dickie Mary is here. And we also have Pastor Nana here. So who am I to do the opening prayer? All right, so I'm just going to call Dickie Sam. <laughs> I wasn't going to call him because I looked at him and he said, ah, I said, oh, yeah, Dickie Sam, you will open his prayer. All right, so let's, um, we're going to rise up to pray. We give honor to whom honor is due. Rise up to pray. Put your bread away. <laughs> let's just commit this into God's hands and um, we'll get the show on the road. Welcome, everybody, and hope you have a good time tonight. Please welcome Dickie Sam. All the way from the other side of Abana Life. <laughs> Hallelujah. Shall we pray? Heavenly Father, we give you praise. We exalt your holy name. Thank you for a time like this. Father, this is the beginning of greater heights for them in the mighty name of Jesus. And your name alone shall be glorified. For we pray with thanksgiving in Jesus' name. Shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Thank you so much, sir. We're going to roll through the program in a very efficient way. All right. So we're going to welcome um, our graduates. Before I start doing praise and worship. Uh -huh. Let's go. Introducing the class of 2024 with so much swag. Hey. Every day by day, I just listen uh -uh. Everything I, I want to see you dancing. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I'm living larger, get and just for my ghetto. Never forget where I come from, not from ghetto. Ah, ah, okay, okay. Hey, don't go too far. Don't go too far. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, it's it. Hey, yeah. So damn. So damn. Aya. Hey. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Ha, 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 ha. Ibo, Ibo, Kwanum. So we scam up and they under. I fire them with the thunder. Hello. Ibo na kuzi kwanu no ju. Ibo na na na. Mano chiro. I cover myself. My kachine can ne me go kwangu benya zake. Every day by day I just they celebrate. Everything I do, we just they penetrate. Oh. I just want to say, oh, thank you, Jehovah. See, I'm living larger, get and just so for my ghetto. Never forget where I come from, not from ghetto. Oh, no, 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 Yay! Of course, now Sam, hey, hey. Sam, Sam, Chief, Sam. Is the one of all of Anambra, the only man with a graduating degree in Anambra. We welcome you. Importer, exporter, pure water. That was wonderful. All right. So now we're going to have a video introduction. So this video will give you a... Uh, you should be coming down. 
Eh? They gave me mic. They didn't give you mic. I told PB, either it goes left or it goes right. Either way, we're going somewhere. Anyways, this video will give a really great introduction to who they are. Uh, it's a really short video, so uh, after then, we'll have a video that will talk about how far they've come. See how far they've come. You see, you know, all the journeys they've been through from the first day they stepped into Lincoln University till now. Are we ready for the video? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever Church Up Award and Graduation Ceremony brought to you by the Abundant Life Youth Church. Introducing our Lincoln University graduates, Ademidun Areshola, Mayua Orutan, Mitchell Igalima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martin Tufio, Tumache Okuneye, Samuel Okezi Imo, and last but not least, hailing from the University of Delaware. Joseph Akinwande, also known as Benoit. That was a beautiful introduction. I actually thought you guys it had more. Or oh, is it the next video? Where's I need you close to me. So we're going to do the video of how far they've come. Uh, that would take about good 10 minutes. Um, I've seen the video, it's really great. Um, sit back, relax, sip your wine. Um,
Okay. So the first award that will be going out is to the funniest person from the graduating class. And this will be presented by Melchizedek. <laughs> well, you people are matching. I love this green. <laughs> and Mina. Are you guys ready? Can we please bring out the award? And the nominees are Mitchell Eagle Lima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martin Tupio, Mayua Orutan, Tumache Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademi Dune Areshola. And last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. And the winner is. Tumiche! Round of applause for Tumiche! The funniest man in class. All right. To present the award for most helpful, this person is always there to help when you call on him or her. They're always there. 12 a.m., 3 a.m., 6 a.m., very helpful. Jokes apart, this person is always, even for me when I saw it, I said, ah, always there, available for church up at every point in time. The award will be presented by Sumande and Fumi. Please, a round of applause as they make their way. Oh, I forgot to mention. This award comes with a gift, monetary gift of $200. Are you people jealous? $200. If you are not clapping, you will drop $200 here. Yeah. $200. Are you guys ready to let us know who it is? Drum roll. And the nominees are Mitchell Eagle Lima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martin Tupio, Mayua Orutan, Tumache Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademi Dune Areshola. And last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. And the winner is Samuel Okezi Imo. Woo! Yeah. Chief Sam! Chief Sam! I, I, don't stop clapping now. I'm the most helpful. A whole 200. Uh -uh. All right. The next award. This person is able to influence, motivate, inspire, aspire. Whenever everyone else is around them, they push them to do what? To do better. It's <laughs> Pastor Nana. <laughs> and Sister Jessie <laughs> will present this award for us. All right, let's have the nominees. Mitchell Eagle Lima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martin Tupio, Mayua Orutan, Tumache Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademi Dune Areshola, and last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. All right, I also forgot to mention that this award also comes with a monetary gift. <laughs> Round of applause for Tumiche. All right. Let's go on to the next award. This next award is for best manners. Whenever I personally see this person, Hmm. Very respectful. I I'll pay this person personal with 200. Check for best manner. Just write his name or her name. See, I almost gave the name out now. All right, best manners. And the nominees are Mitchell Eagle Lima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martin Tupio, 
Mayua Orutan, Tumashe Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademidun Areshola. And last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. And the winner is Samuel Okezi. Chief Sam! Chief Sam! All the way from Manambra. Congratulations. Come on, guys, a round of applause. Okay. This award is going to the most committed. This person had the highest attendance. Why are people speculating? <laughs> Calm down. Be coming down. The most committed, once again, always there at every point in time. Very, very committed. And the highest attendance. I didn't know Church Up was even taking attendance. Hallelujah. All right, we're going to invite Timilai and Lamide to present this award. Uh, are you? Come on, clap for them now. Come on, come on. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. All right, all right, all right, all right. Are we playing the nominees? And the nominees are Mitchell Igalima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martins Hupio, Mayua Orutan, Tumashe Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademidun Areshola. And last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. And the winner is Samuel Okezi Imo. Okay. Come on now, don't be zealous. My God is good, as you can see. Everybody, taste and see the victory. My One more time for Chief Sam. For every trial you brought me through. Thank you for saving me. Now I can't. All right, all right, all right. I want to confirm something as we go along. Church of Leadership did not pick these winners. Everyone in this room voted for the winners. Okay? The election was not rigged. There's no favoritism. Let us clear the L. All right. Next award is for best dress. The most stylish. Ah, hey, hey, you people don't even know what it is. You don't know what it is. Come, be coming down. Yeah. Please welcome Mrs. Victoria Akinwande to present this award. <laughs> Are you ready? Are we playing nominees or no nominees? Mitchell Igalima, Opeyemi Orutan, Martins Hufio, Mayua Orutan, Tumashe Okuneye, Joseph Akinwande, Ademidun Areshola, and last but not least, Samuel Okezi Imo. And the winner is. And the winner is. Joseph Akinfemiwa Akinwande. Okay, okay, DJ, play something. Hey, I'm not never been. Please, let's have a picture, let's have a picture. Hey, I'm not never been. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much, man. Wow. Thank <laughs> you.
It's Funke yet, man. <laughs> Only if you inquire, you understand that joke. <laughs> Hallelujah. All right. This next award. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Most likely to get married first. Come. Uh, you see, you see, you see, commotion. Let me repeat it. Most likely to go down one knee to profess his or her love. Well, if they are going one knee, it will be the guy. So profess his love. Or the lady who will accept a proposal at the right time. We looked at this person and the whole room said, you are the first one that will get married first. Presenting this award for us, the beautiful couple. Ah, you people put, I cannot call my, my leader by a first... Sister Boss, eh? And Brother Jide Balogu. Come on, round of applause. They're about to tell you who will be the first to get married. And the winner is... Come, bro. See you. Call that the award first. <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Now, if we just let you go back to your seat without answering some pressing questions. Come. Bring the award. Bring the award. Bring the award. Stand here. Don't worry, I won't put you on the spot. I'll put you in the circle. How are you doing today? Hold my, hold my, hold my. I'm fine, thank you very much. Yeah, I'm fine, thank you very much. The audience married voice. I'm fine, thank you very much. <laughs> hey! Do you have a girlfriend? We, we, you'll be both calm, be coming down. Be, you see where he's looking at this award? You are the most likely to marry. Answer, are you? Yes, I am. Aha! Kaba, ba, ba, ba. Hey. Is she here tonight? Uh, no, she's not. Hey! So, of all the women and girls in the ALC, you know CI for sure. <laughs> you went outside, Mitchell. Okay. It is well with you. <laughs> it is well with you. Is she a Christian? Yeah, yeah, she is. Hallelujah. Praise God. It's a question I want to ask, but I don't want to ask you here. We'll ask it if you want to put me inside trouble. PB paid me only for one job. She won't bring me back. Congratulations. Thank you very much. When it's time for your wedding, let's talk. You need to, you need to make sure you are properly fitted. Yeah, no you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? All right, give me a mic. It is well. Did we have a runner-up for this? Um, I'm curious who the runner-up is or was. Because the person I thought was most likely to get married. <laughs> uh -uh. Sam is a pastor. Don't, don't bring him into this. Um, okay. The next award. Oh, wow. What a coincidence. This award is going for this person. Hmm. You see, the Bible says many are called, but what? Hmm. Now only this side, no Bible. You people, I don't know what happened. Many are called, but what? Hmm. Based on popular consensus, this person has been identified as the most likely to become a pastor. <laughs> They will graduate <laughs> from Lincoln and go ahead to open a ministry. 
importer, exporter ministries. And we're going to bring up <laughs> Sister Mary and Dick and Sam to present this award. As you please come forward, please be speaking in tongues because this award carry fire. This award, here's the mic, man. Most likely to be a pastor. PB, I don't know if I can say this, but for this award, when we saw the, 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 the results, there was no second contender. There was no third contender. There was no third. It was 100% flat. That means you people, not me, didn't think anybody else could become a pastor. Hmm. Are we ready? And the winner is Pastor Samuel Okeze Imo. DJ, wait, wait, wait. DJ, find the right song for him to. Don't play one Theophilus Sunday self. Let let us rababa as he's coming. Be be as you are coming. You you got it. Don't worry, the, the DJ is coming. I want this one to be special so that when we come to your church, we'll have this video as proof. And if you don't become a pastor, we'll have this video as proof. <laughs> Two, Two, three, four, five, go! This next award, this person is the most likely to own a restaurant. Most likely to own a restaurant. Hmm. Are you people ready? We're going to bring up Mrs. Bola and Mr. Emmanuel to come present this award. All right. Are you guys ready? Wherever this person is, owes us some food for tonight. Are you ready? Drum roll, please. All right. And the winner is... <laughs> Come on! It shocked you. Come, take picture. Imagine this was your kitchen. Take the picture. Another round of applause. For the record, I've not tasted this food. <laughs> you have to prove yourself. All right. We have some special awards for the night. We have some special awards for the night. But before we go to this next award, our pastor missus stepped into the room. So I want everyone to give a round of applause. How you doing, ma? You're looking great tonight, ma. As always, comment ça va? The single thing say you are graduating from France International. <laughs> okay. This next award is going to the African Auntie of the Year. African Auntie of the Year. And we're going to bring up Auntie Akande and Auntie Linda to present this award. A round of applause. Come on. Okay. Before they call the winner, I want you people to clap again. You know why? Before you clap. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, you can open it, man. Because... By the time it's time to announce, it might take a while. We are going to clap again for these two women here. You know why? Hold on. I say, wait. Oh. <laughs> Valerie, calm down. 
They have been feeding the church up crew for the past, I don't know, even before I came, Abby. Two years, three years, four years, five years. Ah, three years. Mommy is counting. Don't be counting now. <laughs> Are you tired of us? <laughs> so I want you to clap for them because every Sunday, they make sure. You see? Ah. You see the graduates? You see? Their belly out of your belly will flow rivers of living water. Thank you so much, Mom. And the winner is. Ademi Doom, right? Adeshola. Auntie of the Year. A round of applause for our auntie, African Auntie of the Year. For this award that you have on the actual graduation day, wear gilly on top of this feet. Honest, just wear gilly. All right. It will be wrong of us to give an award to African auntie and not give African uncle. The African uncle of the year. Where's my second mic? All right, so Brother Anthony, are we ready? Are you ready? All right. And the winner is? Come on. Uh -uh, come on, keep clapping now, African uncle. Good evening, sir. <laughs> I'm Brother Banky. How do you pronounce your last name? Alale? Alale. All right. Participant Award. And the winner is. Martin Sophia. <laughs> Come on now, let's clap for Mr. Martin. All right, this very last award will be given by Reverend Doctor, PhD, BSc, CCM, EFCC, CIA, FBI, what's left? PDP, APC. <laughs> Come on guys, let's give a round of applause. For Pastor Bookie. I was going to say praise God. <laughs> you know you are fired, like fired. So this last award, oftentimes people see outside. You see the people that do the show. You see the people that hold the mic. You don't really see who's behind the stage making it happen. All right, so this award is very special to me because this is someone that when the first week I came, we were rocking together. We were doing everything and everything together. So this is a very special award to me, and it is Behind the Scenes MVP. And the winner is, well, it's not even a nominating category. I, so this is going to be a consistent award every year. So we didn't vote on this. And the winner is, as if I didn't give it exactly. <laughs> Joseph Akiwande! <laughs> Joseph Akiwande! Joseph comes and plays drums when you guys don't see him. He comes and he works hard when you guys don't see it. And you 
see, I'm a person that I appreciate process a lot. Because, you see, people don't see the process. They just see the glamour and then give us our check. We will recycle it for. But I just want you to appreciate him. 12 midnight. Joseph will be here. Fenwa will be here drumming. Nobody will see him. I'll be leaving. I'll lock the door. 12 midnight. Fenwa, I'm leaving. Oh, are you sure you're good? He'll be like, yes, I'm good. He'll be practicing. You guys won't see that. On Sunday morning, you'll just be hearing, do, 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 pa, pa, do, do, pa. you don't see the work he puts in. I see it. Yes, ma. Mommy, please, come and give this award. This, I can't even give this award. I can't even give this award. Mommy, please. Please welcome the first lady of ALC. I said is that he's been playing it since age nine in this church. I mean, I'm just overwhelmed and um, when see your child grows right there in your presence and he has remained consistent, consistent, consistently consistent since age nine. He's one child that I'm really, really proud of and I pray for you that the Lord will take him heights beyond you in Jesus' name. Amen. This church does not pay him a dime. Hallelujah. Neither did, uh, where's my son? The Manzi? Manzi or the Danzi? Amen. Don't pay them, but the Lord pays them. And when you start hearing of them, you will know it's because of the seeds that they have sown in Jesus' name. Uh, come on now, you guys can do better than that. A round of applause. But tonight, I will give a pastor's award of $500. Come on. Are you sitting down? Are you sitting down? Are you sitting or what? Are you sitting or what? $500. An award of $500 and a suit a shirt and a tie for, from Mrs. To her. Congratulations, sir. Wow. Brother Fenwa. 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 Fenwa, remember my cutting. <laughs> Where is Fenwa? Fenwa, my cash up is booking unstoppable. Yeah. Is that really your well, question? I see now. How uh, will he just be collecting our money like wow. that? Wow. You are you should, drinking you water. Drink that water. You should refund the one we gave him since pastor said Can we get our 200 bucks back? We have to raise it. <laughs> as, as a humble man. <laughs> we have to refund. raise that money. I'll send a text to everybody, please. We need to have 100 people to give us 50 bucks. Okay. So are you guys having a good time tonight? All right. And I know I that I think the real question is, are you hungry tonight? That's what I'm saying. Uh -huh. is not finding it funny. <laughs> All right, we're going to um, have some nice music. I would like to recognize the very important, everybody's important. By the way, you all look very nice, very beautiful. Put your hands down for Woo! yourselves. All right, so I'd like to, um, we already saw Pastor, Pastor, Mrs. Dickens, and all the spiritual elders on this table. You guys look, I have special people from Lincoln. You're the, Woo! you are the last. Mr. Lincoln, right? Yeah, he just the last. Mr. Mr. Lincoln, Lincoln in the house. Wait, 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 stand up, stand up, stand up. Yes, he just gave over his title. The last, uh, I think last 
Good Friday. All right, time. We have, um, look, let me tell you, um, Church Up is home to a lot of beautiful people. We have Woman of the Year. Where's Liz? Yes. Woo! That's our Woman of the Year, Miss uh, Lincoln. We have um, President of ASA. Tumisha, can we? He's the President of ASA. And then we have, um, where's David? David left. David is also the President of DASA, DSA, uh, Delaware State, Delaware University. University of Delaware. All right, so we have beautiful, beautiful people in church up. Uh, yes. Hey, hey. Secretary of State. See, our cameraman. This is our cameraman every Sunday. See him. He's the secretary of whatever he said. Yeah, the, <laughs> the Jax General Secretary. And you guys are all beautiful tonight. Um, you guys are going to have a beautiful time. I promise you we still have a little more things to Animazi just strolled in. And when we, anyway, all right, so we're going to go eat, and I think we should do it in order. I'm just going to bless the food real quick. Father, we bless this food in Jesus' name. We ask, oh God, that it will nourish our bodies in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. For those that don't have, okay, Pastor Buki, one drop. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, so we have to figure out how we're going to go. Should we let the graduates go first? And then we'll serve the leaders. Haters, you know, Valerie, you, by the way, okay, can you know, you know what, can I have that stuff? Last week, I was um, at um, Lincoln University, and I witnessed, you see, Church Up, if you don't know, is about unleashing potential. The UP be, uh, behind the name Church Up, it's unleashing potential, and the scripture that we have is, you know, um, we don't just turn up. We, we church, church We don't up. just turn up. We church up. You know, and our scripture is, we are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation. We've been called to show forth the praises of him who has called us out of darkness into his marvelous light. And the only way you can do that is to unleash your potential. You have to unleash your potential. The, they said humanity is waiting for the unleashing of the sons of God. And so we are church up. We unleash in every way, every step, every platform we get, we give it our best. So last week, I was privileged to witness a lady. She, I'm not even playing. She ran for Miss Lincoln. And she gave it everything. Can we put our hands together for Valerie? She gave it everything. She, come here, girl. Come, come, come. I'm sorry to take your time, but listen. She gave it everything. I know that it may look like she didn't win, but she did because she pushed her limits. She became a, the best expression of herself, and I think that is winning. Winning is not when you get a prize. Winning is when you're better than you were yesterday. All right, so I have something that um, I want to give um, Valerie. Can you help me? Turn. Yeah. So this is just a reminder that she should never put her head down. Because when you walk like this, what happens? Whatever is on your head falls down, right? So when you walk like this, your crown stays up. All right. So, this is just a reminder. So, we're giving her the award for Miss Resilience. We saw her push her boundary. Don't let me cry. You know I'm crying. <laughs> so, on behalf of Church Up and the leaders, you are Miss Resilient. And we're giving you this crown, not as a substitute, Listen, you know, you know you can't make me cry. I'm supposed to. <clears throat> so we're giving you this crown. <laughs> I can't reach ahead. I'm too short. <laughs> Bend down, my friend. <laughs> this is a reminder that you must never put your head down. When you walk, you walk like a crown is on your head. You hear me, girl? You walk like that. Every time you walk, you walk like your head is connected to the sky. 
okay? And you walk like a princess. You are a king. You are a priest. And I want to see that. Every single tear you shed, they will water the seed of your destiny. All right, my darling. Can we put, this, put our hands together for Miss Resilience 2024? Woohoo! Give it up for Mrs. Akande. She gives us free food. She, I don't even have to worry every Sunday. Pastor insists, Pastor and Pastor Mrs. insists that the uh, church up guys have to eat. And I don't even Woo. have to worry about that. So we need you here, ma. On behalf of Abundant Come on. Life, you are our first recipient. You are Graduates, uh, uh, you've been eating well. Member. Come on, come on, come on. Your name is engraved. Let me, let me wear it for you. Daniel. Are the right. power invested in me? <laughs> and I'll pronounce you. <laughs> oh, no, right, Give it up. Shut Come up. on. Thank you. Thank you. Woo. All right. And right behind her is her partner in crime, Mrs. Aquari. Come on. Give it up. We have this Mrs. Friday Aquari. night event that they make free puff puff free Zobo, free stuff for us, and I don't even have to, you know, worry about it. So we uh, we appreciate every single effort. So, Miss Aquari, give it up for Miss Aquari. Looking sweet 16. Okay, okay, okay. On behalf of Church Up, we, I need a nice, I need someone to come and be cooking. All right, so thank you so much for all you do for us. Thank you. God bless you. All right, immediately after, see, this man, I, if I tell <laughs> you, this man wakes up every Sunday morning before I wake up to go to Lincoln University to pick them. So please give it up for Woo! Robert Keith. Is he here? Come on now. Oh, he left. All right, who's going to collect this? I'll collect it on his behalf. Just hold on to it. Rabanki, we appreciate you, and God bless you. Dr. Tolu Drojaye, see the tables you're sitting on and all these little, little things that a lot of people don't see. We appreciate it. Uncle Tolu is always there when we need anything arranged, and he never fails. So uh, he's an honorary member of um, uh, Church Up. And then, see, sometimes we don't even have to, you know, worry about our music. 
I don't even know anything about it. This man makes sure that our music, our sound is, you know, on hundred percent. So give it Mike up check. for Brother Jimmy. Woo-hoo! Come on, bro. One leg. One leg. One leg. His leg, <laughs> his right leg. <laughs> ah, what's the stage oh, for insurance? Oh yeah, cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> so you are an honorary member of Church Up. Until he gets we don't here. just turn up. We touch up. So, I need um, somebody to come and help me put it. <laughs> Mommy said, put it. Go. <laughs> Daniel, come. Uh. <laughs> All right, come and take picture of him. Put it. You, come, you are fired. But after this, uh-huh. I'll put it on my LinkedIn. <laughs> so, this is uh, Abundant Life Award for. Supporting for believing for seeing the vision. Pastor cares. 
a child will be in the hospital 12 midnight pastor will stand up i'm not playing sam i'm serious every single step of the way pastor and pastor missus have been there so round of applause Woo! round of applause thank you so much pastor uh, they didn't you take pictures okay 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 All right, so this, um, thank you, sir. All right, so this is, um, nobody knows about this, but this R4, my leaders, is going to go very, very fast. All right, I so ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Timilay Oladujo. Yes, yes, yes. Timilay drives, I, ca I call Timilay anytime. And he's there, and I appreciate, appreciate you. Wow, wow so MC. Okay, so thank you. On behalf of Church Up. All right, this is going to move very fast. Precious isn't here, but Precious is, our, is the leader of the ushering team. Taiwo, Taiwo, ladies and gentlemen. Woo, bro, Taiwo, where is he at? Taiwo, Taiwo. Come on. He drives all the way to Lincoln. And he there just recently joined, uh, joined he, us. He too. just recently joined us, ah. and he's already pulling his way. So on behalf of Pastor and Pastor Mrs. Sai, drive him to the All right. And this lady is always there. 12 midnight, she's there with me in the church. Lamy de Gureja, ladies and gentlemen. Lambs on the gram. Lambs on the gram. Come on. Where is she? Catwalk from the Ecom. <laughs> Lamide featuring our bones straight to be born. <laughs> Lamide is such a help, such an encouragement, and I really appreciate you. And she's BB's twin. <laughs> All right. You don't know? It's just me. <laughs> camera, camera, camera is talking to girl. It, it's moving. Eh? <laughs> no, but I put my brother in trouble. All right. <laughs> and next up, next up, we have Chris. Take a picture. Lambs on the ground. All right. <laughs> uh, leave me for <laughs> Do you hear that thing say? <laughs> All right. This lady may have a tiny voice, but her influence is big and her, she helps a lot. So, ladies and gentlemen, Bumilaya Usua. Woo! Woo! Come on. Come on, proof. Come on, you want my, my voice is not small. Oh, yeah, say yeah. My voice is not small. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, thank you for all you do. Appreciate you. Oh, yeah, come right back. Eh, eh, eh. Loudest voice. All right. Okay. This person recently left us, but he's back for this event. So, ladies and gentlemen, Woo! give it up. Come on. Where is Prayer Elijah? warrior is Elijah. Oh. Aww. He had to make it back to D.C. in yeah, time. Yeah, he moved to D.C. recently. And, yet, yeah. and he was so instrumental to the growth of church. We'll have to ship this one to him. And all the way in Africa, we have Margaret Adenusi. She's not here. Maggie is in charge of the choir. And she d I don't even do speak over that. I was using this as my mic. She's probably somewhere, you know, serving. Give it up for Ajoke Ogulalu. Woo! Woo! Ajoke. Ajoke is in charge of transportation for Lincoln and for the food and everything. And Woo! I don't even have to worry about it. I delegated and I am never disappointed about whatever these kids do. All right. Ajoke featuring a dress, a black dress. Come and take picture. Did you take the award? Take the award. I appreciate you, girl. She can be on the phone for one hour. Pastor P, what are we going to eat? Pastor P, what are we going to do? Pastor P. Like, leave me alone. All right, so we have three more to go. Um, in charge of our band is Imanzi. Imanzi. Imanzi on Give the beat. Give it up for Imanzi. Imanzi on the beat. Uh-uh. Hey. Oh, Nashaka. Hey, le, 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 le. Mazzy on the keys and the bass and the drums and the talking drum. 
MD. Yeah, put it on. <laughs> Has your Grammy MD Award. Isn't <laughs> Grammy is not a medal. <laughs> That's why they never take you guys anywhere. All right, just take us. Show your medal. Are you proud of your medal? All right. Can we give it up for Sun Maid, Pastor Sun Maid? He's a very instrumental to the growth of Church Up. And we misplaced your uh, Tumade, come on. Tumade is a pilot. If you want air miles, it dashes air miles. All right. So please give it up for Tumade. Tumade was one of the people that encouraged me. He will send me a text. PB, don't worry, I got you. You're not doing this alone. I really appreciate all those times, man. Where is the photographer? Photographer is eating. Can we get a picture with your phone? Ah. What a that's selfie. That's <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Somebody, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Somebody will arrange bowling, bring all his friends, and then we'll go bowling and, you know, when we were growing as church up. All right, so the last two we have, we're going to give it at the same time. So this is for Vivian Marugu. Woo! Vivian joined us. Give and us a I clap. Went now that's sleep. my wife. The Vivian bone of my joined bone. us, and I went, she took charge of everything. You guys can all testify to it. Matter of fact, this, this couple, they have been so helpful to me. So this is for Daniel Marugu and Vivian Mar I'll give you both of them. Oh, yeah. All right, so <laughs> if you don't stand here. from our pastor, uh, Pastor Ellis, would like to give a few words um, to encourage the graduates, and then we will close. All right, Pastor. Amen. Two. Please, let's celebrate Jesus for a minute. Amen. Amen. Um, I know that Brabayo thinks that he's going to be here for another 30 minutes. So, the moment he said there is an admonition from the pastor to encourage you, Amen. And GD too. Eh? Praise God. I just want to share with you for just about three minutes. But I need attention, please. Uh, the people that are talking outside, if you are supposed to be inside, I would really like you to come inside and take a seat. I just want to talk to you for about three minutes on uh, things that I will advise you to, to do as you go out, especially the graduates. I'm hoping over the next one year, we'll be able to share more with those that are yet to graduate. But I know that we have limited time with the graduates. Uh, the first thing I'd like to s let you know is that in this world, and I've been around a little bit, when you remove the God factor from any part of your life, there's nothing special about you any longer. The only thing that makes you to be different, the only thing that gives you more influence, more power, the only thing that helps you to succeed where you should have failed is the God factor. The God, God in everything, if you superimpose God over everything you are going to do, I'm telling you that 
you will make it. You will succeed. It doesn't matter the obstacles that you face. You see, the power of God is able to move things that you cannot move. So my advice to you as you go out there, don't think that when you go out there, well, you've done your bit for church, you've done your bit for God, and then you want to face the world. The way you can conquer the world is to have God in everything that you do. Deliberately and purposefully involve God in the things that you do. So make sure that you go with God. And the second thing I would like to advise you to do as you go out into the world is that you should work very hard. There's no substitute for hard work. You know, there is, you know, prayer is not even a substitute for hard work. What would they say is that is work and pray. They didn't say pray alone, you know. So, Bible also says that faith without works is dead. You need to work. You are young now. Work very, very hard. Because of our time, I won't be able to share stories with you. But by the grace of God, I know that it was extra work. Extra work that we did that got us to be here. But me being here in America is extra work that God gave us the opportunity to do. That's what got us here when, when, when the time was right. So I want you to work very hard. I'm not sharing story, you can see. Although you can laugh, but I'm not sharing story. Okay? But I just need to let you know, no substitute for hard work. You are young. You are very young now. Nothing tying you down. You should be able to work wherever you are. You should be able to work for not just eight hours, but ten hours. Even though they pay you for eight hours, work ten hours, work twelve hours. In a day, every day, work sixteen hours. That is how you can make it. That will put you ahead of everybody. And this country, many things are stacked against you already. You are black. Right? Hello? Hello? I think they are adjusting my mic. Okay. Many things are stacked against you. You are black. Most of you are foreigners. You know, it doesn't matter how well you polish your accent. They still detect it. Your name betrays you. So many things are stacked against you. But if you walk very, very hard. Let me tell you, nobody will be able to rubbish you. So that's my second point that I'm advising you. Please, work very, very, very hard. And the third thing that I would like to advise you is that you should be humble. Don't be loud. Do what you need to do. Position yourself. Don't be loud. It's not the loudest person that wins the match. You see, but when you are loud, people will know you. They will size you up. They will look for ways to bring you down. Be quiet. Be, be, do the things that you need to do, you know, with humility. Respect people. Respect other people. You know, be nice to people. And God will help you as you go. The other, the next thing that I would like to advise you, second to the last, is that is bridges. Bridges. Everybody say bridges. Build bridges and maintain them. Build relationship. The biggest currency in this world is not dollar. It's not yen. It's not pound sterling. The biggest currency is the relationships that you build. So, build bridges to people. Get to know people. Make sure that you value everybody. Don't think that, you know, you are, you know, you are a superhuman. You don't need this one. You don't need that one. I'm telling you, you people you think you may not need today, you will need them tomorrow. Build bridges and maintain those bridges. One day, it will pay off. And uh, the last thing that I will advise you about 
is that in everything that you do, I want you never to give up. Whatever obstacles you face, no, 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 don't, don't give up. You have to know from beginning, once you bind with God, you have to know that your success at the end is determined, is, is already determined by God. It's not determined by man. It doesn't matter what man does. So you have to be focused on that success. You have to be focused on that success. You will, you will encounter obstacles. You will encounter problems. People will betray you. People will talk about you. People will do things to you. But I'm telling you that if you are focused on the end goal, you will finally succeed. Don't give up. Don't get tired. Don't, don't, don't let anybody discourage you. Whatever anybody says, you know where you are going. You know where you are headed. And I pray that God will help you in Jesus' name. So I pray for all of you that in Jesus' name, the Lord God will guide you. That the Lord will bless you. That the Lord will hold you by the hand. That God will take you to the top. And in Jesus' name, I pray that in this life, you will not fail. You will not fall. You will not falter. You will not stumble. In, G in this life, you will fulfill the purpose for which God created you. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for you that in the name that is above all names, God will send help to you in the nick of time. In the name of Jesus. Where you need help, help will arise for you. Men and women, wherever you go, I pray men and women will rise up to be a blessing to your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. And those of you that are graduating, I pray that every time we hear about you, it will be good news. And every time you hear about us, it will be good news. You will not die before your time. You will not die unfulfilled. You will not die unsuccessful. In this life, in Jesus' name, you will reach your goal. I pray for you that in the name of Jesus, your destiny will not be cut short. Your destiny will not be corrupted. In the mighty name of Jesus, so shall it be. In Jesus' name we pray. Come and celebrate Jesus. All right, so now we want all the uh, graduates to stand up. We want to present you with this certificate on behalf of Abundant Lives Church Up. We present to you, they are still seated. Which part of stand up? Okay, they say I should be nice to you. So we would like you to just rise up from your chairs. Put on your cap and gown. <laughs> My friend Lute. <Lou. laughs> All right, so coming up first, we have, can we invite Pastor and Pastor Mrs., please? I would have bought doctorate gown for you with big hat. <laughs> okay, so mommy, please. So you guys. Lami. Lami. <laughs> Let me do. Master, no, Master, this Can you this. please get Elijah, Elijah to suspend his eating? Suspend your eating. We'll give you uh, McDonald's. No, 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 no. My brother Elijah, no, no, photographer. We need him. I'll just give mommy. Yeah. I'll, just give. I'll just hand it over. All right. We're just giving him. All right. So, guys, guys, come here. Come here. I'm so proud of you guys, man. I know I probably don't say it enough, but I really am. I'm so proud of you. I've seen you guys grow from your low cut to your dreadlocks, from your dreadlocks to your low cut. I've seen you guys grow, and I am so proud of you guys. And like Pastor said, go into the world and make a mark, okay? Unleash your potential and let the world see that you, you came from somewhere, okay? And walk like kings. All right. Dan, uh, Auntie, Uncle, stand here. All right. First off, we have Martin Zufio. Martin Zufio. Come on. A round of applause. A round of applause.
Tumiche Okunaye. Tumiche Okunaye. Give it up. Give it up for Tumiche. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, do your work. Uh huh. Michelle Igloma. Come on, Michelle. Most likely to get married first. Thank you very Thank much. You so much. All right, can we give it up for our pastors? Grace, can we have the graduates here? Can we have the cake? Fumilaya donated this cake for us again, so uh, a round of applause. Hmm. Okay, people need support. Uh, in front, uh, make sure you face this way. So, yeah, Ma, you are coming this way. Uh -huh. And you like their hair cut? Their hair was cut by Brandon. Um, huh? Mr. Rich's brother, he's going to be at our health fair, cutting hair with his friends. Yes, yeah, sealed and stamped in Jesus' name. All right, so this okay. acts like you guys perfect. like each other, this you know, just for this night. You do. Oh, I, I couldn't tell. <laughs> All right, so well, I will spell uh, supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Okay, just I'll just spell Jesus. Okay. All right. Uh, J, can I hear a J? Yes. E, e, S, yes. U, yes. S, cut the cake. What is that, Jesus? We're so proud of you guys. We love you guys. Where's Pastor? Pastor, please, join them. Please, please. <laughs> Pastor, Mrs. I'm so, I can't believe you guys are actually graduating. Wow. Pastor, can you come to this side, please? They're leaving. So pray for them. They're so coming back. Come <laughs> we can pray. Oh, we can pray for you guys to come back. All right, where's the camera? <laughs> I should be there too now. Nah, take. So, can we share the grace? The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore in Jesus' name. 
Surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. I pray for you specially that the grace of God will go before you. You will not be intimidated. You will not be robbed of your identity. Your identity will always be before you. You will know who you are. Situations and circumstances will not dictate who you are. You will not compromise your values. You will not sell your virtue for the wiles of Babylon in Jesus' name. You will stand flat-footed as Christians, as members of Abundant Life Church up. In Jesus' name, everything you lay your hands on will prosper. Amen. Favor will go before you. He will enlarge your steps so that your feet don't slip. Amen. Pray for you in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 All right, DJ, can we have some music and dance and then we'll cut the cake and go home.